The rise of the robot. Robotic surgery is now mainstream in prostate removal to treat cancer. Its rise in momentum may be credited to the way it fine-tunes surgery. Viewed as uh, minimally invasive procedures, the, the main benefit that kind of pushed um, these techniques uh, onto the surgical scene was the fact that there was less blood loss and also shorter hospital stays. Mainly due to increased visualization and better maneuverability. If you were to view the operating room during a procedure, you'd see the surgeon sitting across the room from the patient at a console, using magnified 3D high def vision, controlling the instruments with hand controls much like a video game. We actually operate through these uh, keyhole incisions using a camera, and so we don't actually have to make a big incision to operate. The purpose of the robot is, is to allow us to use wristed instruments and which allows us to suture a lot easier. Data shows the overall outcome matches the traditional open technique. Where the robot excels is in patient satisfaction. Less cutting translates to less pain, blood loss and lower infection rates and a quicker recovery. Another factor that impacts success rate is the experience of the surgeon. There is a a learning curve to something like robotics. A lot of the newer trained urologists or, or other surgical specialists are now seeing they've gotten robotic training during their residency and so the learning curve is a little less steep. Dependent on the human touch, the rise of robotics is changing the landscape of the operating room. For Lee Memorial Health System, I'm Amy Osher.